Um, apparently he opened my box and he wasn't supposed to. And in my box was a few purses that I purchased from Shein, which I'm sure everybody's heard of. And no, this is not sponsored. This is literally from my own coins. And my little cute style that I took a look at and I saw some stuff that I really liked, so I wanted to try them out. So, these are just four purses. There's one that I got on eBay. Um, it's supposed to be a dupe for YSL, but the L looks like a kind of an E, but we'll see. I'll go ahead and show you guys that. But um, in the meantime, I really wanted to take a look at this small cute one. It's kind of like a boxy purse. If you guys can see, it has some gold. Ooh, I thought it was brown. It's not. Ooh, look at that. Oh my god, how pretty is that? And then we open this just like that. Oh my god, that's really freaking pretty. Look at that. And no, it doesn't say any fancy me because it's from Shein, but that doesn't matter. I don't care. As long as it's pretty and something that I can actually use, which the box inside is pretty good too. Looks really sturdy. I'm going to close this up. I'm going to take these um, class, I want to think this is called. Um, and then I'm going to clamp them onto the side like that. And then... Oh, okay. They're just a little different. They're not like hook hooks. But like, oh my god. Let's see. I can't wait to use this. It's so pretty. I love the gold tone. It looks like more like rose gold. I love the little details here. It's really nice, pretty, shiny, hard, sturdy. I can't wait to use that. I really love it. I purchased a few things from Shein before, um, clothes wise, but they're kind of hard to like figure out if they're going to fit you very well, especially because they're very curvy. Um, but when it comes to purses, as long as they're sturdy and they actually hold well, I don't need to worry if they fit or not. Look at that. I thought this was really cute. This is more for like fall. Um, almost like spring too in my opinion. Just because um, it has white in it. Look at that. I'm going to take this off. Look how pretty the details is. It's so pretty. And look. The stitching is really nice. The back is real nice. Again, real sturdy. I don't have the prices on what I've spent on these. Um, I'll link them on the link below or the description. Um, I hope that... No, I, I can find out. I can find out. And then I'll... There's three different compartments here. It has this little piece. It doesn't have a zipper. Um, but you don't really need a zipper. Um, necessarily and it does come with these clamps here on the side okay so um, some of the stuff that are gonna come you know it's Shein for crying out loud and it's what I paid for but if you look at that the very small details you can see that that's coming out but oh wait that could be the back side because this one's fine there's nothing there but I really like the details in that it has the hooks here onto the side where's the camera pushing here Okay, and it has just these little clamps, and then again, clamp those. Where do you clamp them? Clamp them here? That's kind of... Okay, well, maybe I don't like that very much. I mean, I guess I could, but I really like this. This is really pretty. I feel like I could put my phone in here, a few different things. Um, pretty sturdy, and if my son gives me a few toys to hold on to have a place for those two okay so that's number two let's go with number three for this one i think i got two different colors um they were really pretty um and i couldn't decide um should be fine for the next season 
but I thought this was so pretty. But I wasn't sure if it was going to be suede or not, but it's not at all. It's pretty nice. Let's see. <gasps> just comes right up. Very sturdy. Zipper. <gasps> a dead rat came with it. No, just kidding. Um, it's a fluffy ball, which... It doesn't smell like it was alive at all, so we're good. So that's cute. That's a little accessory. Um, that's just nothing. But everything here, pretty sturdy again. They're really good quality purses in my opinion. I feel like if purses like this, I went to the mall and just kind of took a look at like the cheaper ends of purses. Uh, no name brands or anything because these are all not name brands obviously, but... I checked out um, a few different ones and they run from anywhere from like 25 to 30, sometimes 40 is ridiculous enough, could be 60. Um, and I'm not okay with paying for that much for um, purses because I like so many of them and I just can't afford um, such insane prices. Um, they have different things to pay for. So I'd rather just pay um the 12 13 15 even 25 for a person she in um instead of purchasing all these other big name brands and you know i mean unless they get a discount from like macy's because they do have some brand names like michael kors purses and stuff like that but in all honesty they're so ridiculously overpriced that i just don't understand they're all made in china they might as well just get it straight from china and pay 12 dollars. like i'm okay with that um, comes with this. This is okay. I really don't care about this. I really do like these clamps. These clamps are so much better. Look like they're very sturdy. It's very cute. You can use this again fall or actually even spring at nighttime. I think it's really pretty. And then if you go ahead and, and clamp this little thing on here to the side, I think it gives it like a cute little extra something, something, you know? nice but I was playing around about it being uh, dead because you know you know okay, it's moving on here is the same one in a different color it does look like sway on the site but I mean stuff like that you can't really tell until you actually get it oh my god I love this Okay, no, it's not the same one. It's very different. Thought it was the same one, but I keep seeing these like um, embellishments, I want to say, or like these details in different purses. And every time I see them, I feel like it almost looks 3D from far away. Um, I thought it was going to be more like detailed and like this is just printed on. Um, but I thought it was going to be more like it was going to be like a different material cut out right on top and the whole um, bottom part was going to be black. That was going to be a little bit more, but I mean, I didn't pay that much again. So from far away, it looks good, right? In my opinion. I don't know. The clamps still look cute. I think they would have been nicer, a little bit better if they were not gold. And instead of gold, they were either rose gold or silver. That would be a little bit better. Again, pretty sturdy purse. Um, Oh, okay, this one comes with a little detail too. Look at that. It's so hard. Oh. oh, I like it. Okay, so might as well just. So it goes through the little thread here. And then, or thread, it goes through the little metal piece. And then right here, you see that? It's a little opening so you could stick the tassel in there. Now, again get what you pay for the tassel is a little in my opinion a little poorly made that's all right as long as long as it works from far away you can't tell and if people are looking to see what i'm wearing or what brand it is then that's really their problem not really mine but yeah so that's that and then i also mentioned the ysl version of um a purse that i got on a website that we all buy on. I think I said it earlier, but I'm not sure. But if I didn't, oh well. Um, I I saw there was one that had like an eight here. This one doesn't have an eight. This one has the fake E L E L L E. I don't know. 
but I thought this was really cute. If I could try to figure out how I can take this portion off, then I'd be gold. Um, and this was only like $25. I remember that because it was the only one I bought from that website. Um, because I really didn't care too much about purchasing other things in there. Um, but again, it's pretty sturdy. And who's going to be able to tell that this isn't necessarily 100% real? Like, unless you're really, really lucky. And then again, and if you're really, really looking, you're really, really that interested, and you don't even know me, and you want to find out if this is a real purse, I mean, that's really your problem, not really mine, because I'm not spending $1,000 on a purse. It's just not going to happen. It is what it is. Um, and that is it. I'm just going to be showing you guys the purses. This is number five. Here over here is my absolute favorite. This is number one that I showed you guys that I opened. Okay. Number two is my second favorite. I really love this. I think it's really cute, very cowboy, yet not. I don't know. Grandma, the cowboys have little embellishy thingies like this, like little threads. I think so. They do. Okay. Well, it is cowboyish, I guess. Um again, I really like this one too. Um, so if I would rate them, this is number one, 100% number one, and I actually want more in different colors, um, which I think I'm going to do. This one's number two. This one's number three, only because this right here, I just don't like this. I like everything else. I'm just going to take this part off or put it away until I, I mean, if I need to put it on, I'll do that. And then this one here, I really, 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 really like. It's really pretty. Um... But this falls on number four on my list. No, you know what? I put this on number five on my list because of the fact that this is just something that they printed on there. And it's just a regular purse with some little clampy clamps, little rings. Um, and then my YSL would be number four. Number four? Yeah, number three. Who knows? I don't know. I like them all. These are all good buys. I would recommend Shein um, for some purses. Um, if you can't necessarily buy like a designer, like these are really good options. And for the price, you can't really beat it. It didn't take forever to get here neither. It wasn't like a purchase that lasted like a month or two months. Like I literally just purchased these like, I want to say a week. No, not even on Thursday. And today is what, Friday? No, I ordered this on Sunday. And today is Friday. So I got it on Friday. It only took like seven days. So it wasn't even that long. Guys, these are good purchases. These are good buys. I would say go to Shein right now. Look at some stuff. If you don't like anything, okay, fine. But I kind of highly doubt that you're going to find something that you don't like. I really, really like these purchases. They're really, really cute. If you have any questions, please feel free to comment below, like, subscribe. Um, welcome to 2019. This is what I'm doing. I'm so scared to do it, but I'm doing it. Um, let's see what else. Oh yeah. Hi guys. My name is Abby. <laughs> Bye. I'll see you later.